Today, we're diving into the mind-bending world of time travel. Fasten your seatbelts because we're about to embark on a journey through the very fabric of space and time, exploring the paradoxes that make time travel one of the most tantalizing and perplexing concepts in the universe. You see, time travel isn't just the stuff of science fiction. It's a concept that physicists grapple with, a concept rooted in the very equations that describe the cosmos. We're talking about Einstein's theory of relativity wormholes and the possibility of alternate timelines. It's a cosmic puzzle that could rewrite our understanding of reality. Over the next few minutes, we'll be unraveling five bizarre paradoxes that emerge when we dare to imagine traveling through time. From the predestination paradox to Polchinski's paradox, we'll be your guide through these chronological conundrums. So, if you love exploring the mysteries of the universe, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating content. Get ready to have your mind blown wide open as we venture into the enigmatic realm of time travel. Our first stop on this chronological odyssey brings us face to face with the predestination paradox. Now imagine this, you build a time machine, strap yourself in and travel back in time to prevent some tragic event. You're on a mission to rewrite history to save the day before disaster strikes. But here's the twist. Your very presence in the past, your attempts to alter the timeline, end up contributing to the event you're trying to prevent. It's a cosmic case of unintended consequences where cause and effect become intertwined in a dizzying dance. Think about it. You travel back to save your lover from a car accident. But in a strange turn of events, you become the reason that accident occurs. It's a mind-boggling concept, a causal loop where your actions are both the cause and the effect of the event you're trying to change. The predestination paradox forces us to confront the mind-blowing possibility that the past is immutable, unchangeable. It suggests that even if time travel were possible, our ability to alter the past might be severely limited, locked in a predetermined cosmic dance. Our next stop on this journey through time takes us to the perplexing realm of the bootstrap paradox. This paradox is a fascinating and mind-bending concept that challenges our understanding of cause and effect, and it has intrigued scientists, philosophers, and storytellers alike for decades. This paradox is all about origins, or rather the lack thereof. It raises profound questions about the nature of existence and the flow of time. How can something come into being if it has no clear point of origin? The bootstrap paradox forces us to reconsider our conventional notions of linear time and causality. It's a cosmic riddle that asks the question, where did something come from if it seems to have always existed? This enigma challenges our understanding of the universe and the laws that govern it. It suggests that there may be phenomena that exist outside the boundaries of our current scientific knowledge. Imagine a piece of information, an object or even a person being sent back in time only to become the very source of its own existence in the past. This creates a loop where the future and the past are inextricably linked and the distinction between cause and effect becomes blurred. It's a scenario that defies our intuitive understanding of time. It's a self-creating loop, a chronological conundrum where cause and effect chase each other's tails through the corridors of time. This loop can be visualized as a Mobius strip, a surface with only one side and one edge, symbolizing the seamless and continuous nature of the paradox. Think about a famous musician who meets a time traveler claiming to be their biggest fan. This encounter sets the stage for a paradoxical sequence of events that will forever alter the musician's life and career. This time, Traveller shares sheet music for the musician's most iconic song, a song they haven't written yet. The musician is astonished by the beauty and complexity of the composition, and they are inspired to create the song, believing it to be an original work of their own. Inspired, the musician creates the song, unaware that they owe their masterpiece to their future self. This creates a loop where the song has no clear point of origin. It exists because it was brought back from the future and it was brought back from the future because it exists. The bootstrap paradox is a head scratcher because it eliminates the need for an original creator, an initial point of origin. It challenges our understanding of creation and existence, suggesting that some things may simply exist without a clear beginning. It suggests that some things might exist outside the normal flow of time, popping into existence fully formed, 
their origins shrouded in the mists of time travel. This idea opens up a realm of possibilities for understanding the universe and our place within it. It invites us to explore the mysteries of time and existence and to consider the profound implications of a universe where the past, present and future are intertwined in ways we can barely comprehend. Okay folks, buckle up because we're about to dive into a real head-scratcher. The Grandfather Paradox. This one's a classic, the kind of thought experiment that keeps physicists up at night and for good reason. Imagine, if you will, the ability to travel through time. You've got the technology, you've punched in the coordinates and you're ready to rewrite history. But what happens when you set your sights on, shall we say, a family reunion of a very permanent kind? What if you decided to erase your grandfather from existence? This is the crux of the grandfather paradox. If you were to go back in time and remove your grandfather from the equation before your parents were even a glimmer in the universe's eye, would you still exist? You see, no grandfather means no father and no father. Well, that's where you seemingly blink out of existence. But it gets weirder. The very fact that you could travel back in time to commit this act suggests you exist. Right, so does the universe split into two, creating an alternate timeline where you never existed? Or does something else entirely happen, something that our current understanding of physics can't quite grasp? The grandfather paradox isn't just a quirky idea, it's a profound question that challenges our very understanding of time and causality. Great minds like Einstein and Hawking have pondered over these questions, trying to unravel the mysteries of time travel. At its core, the paradox delves into the relationship between cause and effect. If you eliminate the cause, can the effect still exist? It's like looking into a mirror and seeing your reflection disappear because you changed something in the past. The implications are mind-boggling. If you change the past, does the present alter instantly, or is there a ripple effect that takes time to manifest? Scientists have proposed various theories to address these questions. Some suggest the existence of parallel universes where each decision creates a new reality. In this scenario, erasing your grandfather would simply create a new timeline where you never existed, while the original timeline remains unchanged. Others propose that the universe has a way of correcting itself, preventing paradoxes from occurring. This is known as the self-consistency principle. According to this principle, any actions you take in the past would be part of history all along, ensuring that the timeline remains consistent. Then there's the idea of a causal loop, where events are predestined to occur in a way that prevents any contradictions. In this loop, your attempt to erase your grandfather might be the very reason you exist, creating a closed loop of cause and effect. The grandfather paradox forces us to confront the limits of our understanding and the mysteries that lie beyond. As we continue to explore the possibilities of time travel, one thing is certain. The answers are as elusive as they are fascinating. So the next time you ponder the mysteries of time, remember the grandfather paradox and the ultimate family feud it represents. It's a reminder that the past, present and future are intricately connected in ways we are only beginning to understand. And who knows, maybe one day we'll unlock the secrets of time travel and solve the paradox once and for all. Until then, keep questioning, keep exploring and keep wondering about the ultimate family feud. All right, let's talk about a paradox that's practically hardwired into our collective imagination, the let's kill Hitler paradox. It pops up in movies, books, you name it. The concept of time travel has fascinated humanity for generations, sparking countless stories and theories. From H.G. Wells' The Time Machine to modern blockbusters like Back to the Future, the idea of bending time to our will is irresistible. The idea is deceptively simple. If time travel were possible, why not go back and prevent one of history's greatest atrocities? Imagine stepping out of a time machine in the early 20th century, armed with the knowledge of the future, ready to change the course of history. It seems logical, even noble, right? The thought of saving millions of lives and preventing a global catastrophe is undeniably appealing. It's a scenario where you could be the ultimate hero, altering the past to create a better future. The paradox arises from the very motivation behind the act. 
The moment you decide to travel back in time to kill Hitler, you're driven by the knowledge of the horrors he caused. But what happens if you succeed? If you succeed in erasing Hitler from history, the horrific events he instigated never happen. The Holocaust, World War II, and all the associated suffering are wiped from existence. The world you return to is fundamentally different. The world breathes a sigh of relief. But here's the catch. Without the Holocaust, without World War II unfolding as it did, what would be your motivation to travel back in time in the first place? The very reason for your journey is erased, creating a paradox. The very reason for your journey is erased. This creates a loop where your actions negate the need for those actions, leading to a confusing and contradictory situation. This paradox highlights the intricate, almost paradoxical relationship between cause and effect, especially when we're messing around with the potential of time travel. The fabric of time is delicate and altering one thread can unravel the entire tapestry. It's like trying to untangle a knot by pulling on both ends simultaneously. You just end up tightening the mess. The more you try to fix things, the more complicated and tangled they become. It forces us to confront the uncomfortable possibility that even our best intentions when projected onto the vast canvas of time can have unintended and paradoxical consequences. The universe operates on a delicate balance and our interference can tip the scales in unpredictable ways. It makes you wonder, are we really in control of our destiny or are we just along for the ride? The allure of changing history is powerful but it comes with the realization that our actions have far-reaching consequences. Perhaps in the end, the best we can do is learn from the past and strive to create a better future without trying to rewrite history. Now let's dive into a paradox that's a bit more, shall we say, physics-heavy Polkinski's paradox. This one takes us deep into the realm of theoretical physics involving wormholes, time travel, and some very unfortunate billiard balls. Picture this. Imagine a wormhole, a theoretical shortcut through space-time connecting two points in time. Now imagine a billiard ball shot towards this wormhole. Instead of passing through normally, the ball ends up entering the wormhole at an angle, traveling back in time to collide with its younger self. This collision, however, disrupts the younger ball's trajectory, preventing it from ever entering the wormhole in the first place. Here's where the paradox rears its head. If the younger ball was never able to enter the wormhole, how could it have traveled back in time to collide with itself? So there you have it, five bizarre paradoxes of time travel that have captivated physicists, philosophers, and science fiction enthusiasts for years. From the self-erasing motivations of the let's kill Hitler paradox, to the mind-bending physics of Polkinski's paradox, these thought experiments force us to confront the limits of our understanding of time, causality, and the very fabric of reality. Thanks for watching. Which time travel paradox blew your mind the most? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more intriguing videos. Until next time, keep questioning the universe.